Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Bardo and welcome back to another video. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I tape my hockey stick. As you hockey players know, it is vital to the sport of hockey to have your stick taped the right way. Uh, it increases performance, increases control, everything. I'm going to be showing you guys how I tape my stick and how you can too. And to my subscribers, I'm sorry it's been too long without a video, but I'm currently working on this project right now. Uh, it's going to be huge. It'll huge be a problem. problem. It's a huge problem. The huge problem. That is a huge problem. So you think he has a bigger problem? I think he's got a huge problem. It's a huge heroin problem. Probably be up next week, so stay tuned for that, and let's get right into the video. The first step to taping your stick is taking off the old tape. All right, there we go. We've got the Bauer Vapor 1X Lite and it is ready for a tape job. Let's do this. On to step two. We're gonna need some tape and wax. There we go. Ah, oh, God, I forgot the scissors. Here we go. That's better. Now I have all my materials, including this. Let's start taping it. All right, guys, so what I use to tape my stick is some white Howie's hockey tape. So let's put that on right now. I go from heel to toe, and I go all the way through. You'll see what it looks like in just a minute. All right guys, so we've gotten to the toe of the blade, and as, as you guys will tell, I do this a lot differently. So the tape can't fully go over, so what I like to do is I like to make a tab by folding this tape over right here, as you guys can see. And then pulling the tape, and then making another strip through here. I'm gonna do the same thing right here, make a tab, fold it over. Take a tab, fold it over, and just keep doing this till you get to the end. Alright, now that I'm done making tabs, I'm just going to cut off the tape right here, up top. These scissors kind of suck. There we go, alright. So, I've cut off the top. And now we just kind of cut off these tabs as nice as we can make them. So just cut around here, get to the end, just kind of cut this off too. Again, these scissors aren't the greatest. Kind of Alright guys, here is our freshly taped stick, not the best, at least not the best yet. There's still some things we need to do with the wax and the wax bottle, and I'll show you guys how we do that right now. Okay guys, so after you're done taping your stick, it's still going to be a bit um, uneven. What you're going to want to do is just, uh, a lot of people like to use pucks, but I don't really like the way it looks on the white tape. So I'm going to use my tin of Howie's Wax, and I'm just going to go over this, just like this, and just try to smooth out some of the creases right here. Do the same on the back end as well. Alright, so now as you guys can tell, it looks a lot better. It's a lot more uh, grippy, as you guys can hear. Okay guys, just listen to this. This is me rubbing my knuckle against the lines. It's very clean. All right, so now that you've got a good tape job, now that you've made it all smoothed out, you're gonna wanna grab your wax. And just kinda press pretty hard and just wax it. Wax your stick up and down. I like to go on the lower half because that's where most of the ice gets 
and the wax kind of keeps out the ice and gives you a little bit better grip on the puck. Then take this part and just kind of move it around on the bottom of the blade, on the toe. I'll do the same for the backhand side. Okay guys, so now that we're done taping our stick, that's about it. If you guys do want to see a part two, where I'll be explaining how to take the knob of my stick, which is also very important, I'll give that to you. If this video does well, I'll make a part two. And again, stay tuned for my big project. It'll be dropping probably sometime next week, as soon as I can make it. So, yeah, thank you guys so much for the support. We recently hit 850 subscribers. I think that's pretty insane. So make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, all that stuff, because we are so close to 1,000, you can almost feel it. It's gonna be so crazy when we hit that. So yeah, guys, keep up the support, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.